Assalamu alaikum friends hope you all are fine today my topic is hair fall as you know hair loss and thinning hair are common nowadays especially start from teen to old age there are many types of hair loss androgenetic alopecia in this term male and female pattern blindness it is very common cause of hair loss this blindness cause of genetic in this term male loss hair in a temple and crown and female hair become thin all over the head female pattern blindness in this blindness women hair loss shortly after giving birth due to decrease estrogen level This type of hair loss is temporary condition and it resolves sooner. Telogen aphthalmia. In this term, natural hair shedding happens. Hair loss sometime in handful. Telogen aphthalmia is a temporary condition and it resolves over the time. Anagen aphthalmia. In this type, large amount of hair fall rapidly. during anagen phase of hair cycle alopecia areata in this type your arch immune system affect your hair and your hair fall out suddenly the immune system attacks your hair follicle along with your other healthy part of the body hair fall out from your scalp as well as your eyebrow eyelashes and may fall out in a small chunks direction alopecia In this type, hair loss due to pulling hair into a tight hair style. Medication. Certain medication have a side effect that can cause hair fall. So friends, now I'm telling you the causes of hair fall. Childbirth. It is very common cause in women. It can cure by the time passes and good vitamin intake. Cancer treatment. In this case, Cancer treatment have a radiation therapy, chemotherapy. These things commonly affect your hair, but hair regrow after six to twelve months. Fungal infection. In this cause, fungal infection affect your scalp. It is mostly affect your school going kids, and happens because kids share his caps brush with their friends. Thyroid problem. This cause hair fall because thyroid control numerous metabolic process. Protein deficiency. Mostly in this cause those people affect who are doing strict dieting without taking proper diet plan. Hair styling. We all are doing a lot of things with our hair. We do styling, coloring, heating. All these things affect on our hairs. Unhealthy lifestyle. In this cause, people depend mostly on junk food, ready to cook food, and these all things have zero vitamins. By the time passes, your hair quality get worse. Water use. In this cause, if you are using salty water for your hair wash, your hair get weak and thin. and it start falling handful of amount now friends i am giving you a solution of your all hair fall problems these home remedies can control your hair fall tip number 1 take a half cup of aloe vera gel 3/4 cup of coconut oil mix it and use it 2 hour before hair wash apply for 1 hour and see the result tip number 2 apply fresh amla juice on your scalp for 30 minutes and wash hair with mild cleanser it's used twice a week tip number 3 apply onion juice on the scalp for 30 minutes wash it with a shampoo use this tip twice a week and it help to regrow your hair tip number 4 Soak one fourth teaspoon of fenugreek seed, 
and half cup of water for two hours and apply this water only on a scalp after hair wash. It 90% cure your hair fall. Step number five. Everyone know about neem, neem tree. Neem tree have a medical properties. It is very effective herb to treat hair fall. It is especially effect on a fungal infection on a scalp and excellent cure of dandruff. So friends, grind neem leaves and make a paste. Apply the, this marks on your scalp for 30 minutes and wash it with the shampoo. Use this step twice a week. Take two tablespoon of yogurt and one tablespoon of honey and lemon few drops. Apply this mask on your scalp. Leave it on 30 minutes and wash it with a mild shampoo. Tip number seven. Use pumping seed oil for your scalp massage before hair wash. It helps to regrow your hair. Scalp massage stimulate your hair follicle. Promote your hair growth faster. Tip number eight. Take a good biotin and take which is usually found in nuts, sweets, potato, egg, onion. All tips are effect when your diet is good, when your vitamin intake is good. So friends, hope this video is informative for you. If you have any question regarding any disease, you can ask me in a comment section. And also like, share this video, subscribe my channel and hit the bell notification on so you get my latest videos. Thank you for watching.